What is your favorite sense? Oh, I have to pick one? Oh. <laughs> uh, is this a trick question? My favorite sense, that's tough. Um, um, what is your favorite sense? Favorite sense for me would have to be... Wow, my favorite sense. <laughs> That's the name of Sensory Overload. That's kind of what we're going for. One of the great things about dance is that we all have the same instrument. So if I wave, my hand, you know what that feels like. So we take it a step further. So it'd be it'd be great if if um, you just people that come to the sensory overload tonight could just get a little touch more of the feeling of what we're doing, how we're moving, what that might feel like, just by watching. Usually we, we, you know, we have incense and fog and we have uh, visuals and lights that are synced with all of our songs, um, which takes care of the lighting and it's just massively loud. <laughs> so it, it is pretty uh, much sensory effortless. <laughs> um, you know, we try to, to break that barrier and, and get people in a different place than regular music does. You know? And it's the best way for me to communicate with people. There's this material world that we go about our day and, you know, wake up and do normal things, but when you start to observe life, then you create art out of it, uniting people. You know, I think that we're all extensions of each other. So when you start to watch the video, eye after eye after eye after eye, black, white, I even have animals in there, I've got dogs and lizards and all kinds of things, you start to realize that you're, you're connected in some way to all these people that you don't even know. What I love about an event like this is it brings all the creative loafers together and all of them have different definitions of what that means. I want people to feel like in Tampa, they can still be surprised, and I hate for it to be like you could settle here. You know, it's not for retirees; it's for people who are like exploring. Primarily, the takeaway from sensory overload is drunkenness. I am really drunk. I think <laughs> it's a chance for the issue of creative loafing to come to life, and all the departments to. Uh, step into reality for people to interact and touch and sense what we do one night a year. <laughs> 